Hello, Les from Thailand here. Today's video is going to be about hydroponics. I've started a little hydroponics farm at my house here in Rayon. I've never done it before. I've looked at many, many YouTube videos on how to do it. And it's a little hobby. Gives me something to do also. And I always used to enjoy gardening back in England. So I'm going to give it a go. So I'm going to show you some photographs of what I got and keep you updated as to how things are going um, from month to month. I started off by buying a, a greenhouse. It's six metres by three. And that was about 7,200. Um, I've gone with the Dutch bucket system with regard to um, growing tomatoes, bell peppers and nutrient film technique. I've started that on a very very small scale but I've gone with the deep water culture because I, I like that best. I think it's easier, easier to look after. Um, I put the electrics from the house into the garden uh, and then also into the greenhouse so I can run a, a pump and a, a filter system and the aeration system for the for the water. So please follow me if you like it. If you want to watch more videos on that or ask any questions, I'll let you know as much as I know. But for now, I'll show you some photographs and then I'll come back at the end and explain what the photographs are. The photograph that you've just seen is the Dutch bucket system. And in that one, I've got eight, eight plants set up at the minute, eight Dutch bucket system. And what I've done, I've used pumice as the substrate with a mixture of coir. Uh, now these are <coughs> these are non-disease bearing uh, substrates so you don't get any of the diseases from the soil so this system of doing it is totally soilless and the only nutrients it gets from the water that you pump into it and the nutrients that you put in the water so I've got a, a small fish pump which pumps the water to each bucket system there's a drain in, in the bucket so it never ever overflows and it just pumps it into there then it drains back into the water system and it just recirculates and recirculates and recirculates this is my first attempt at doing it so hopefully fingers crossed will bear some good fruits at the minute there's just eight buckets there but i've got another eight set up ready to put my bell pepper plants in which will be next week the second photograph that you'll see is the deep water culture now this is only a small tray re really that I've started just to see how it works and what basically what this is you get some polystyrene you drill some holes into it you fill the tray up with with nutrient water and they just leave it um, I've subsequently been told to put an aeration um, device in there like a, an aeration pump from a, a fish tank and that oxygenates the water which then helps the plants also so I'll be doing that eventually um, the one that I've got set up in the greenhouse that will be getting done next week with regard to the aeration system put in there and in the next few days I'll have the the um, the pumice in the other buckets and I'll get me pepper plants all together I'm hoping to have maybe 25 30 tomato plants and about 10 or 15 bell peppers. I'm also growing lettuces um, and cucumbers. So let's see how it grows. If there's anybody out there that's already doing it and want to give me some advice, please, please feel free to give me some advice. But I've looked at loads and loads and loads of videos and it'll give me something to do as well. I've got the garden, I've got the room to do it. So fingers crossed, thumbs up, hopefully it'll work. Thanks very much. Until the next time, bye for now.